character options announced yesterday that new figure lines are coming to their collections in November of next month. These action figures are available from B&M in the UK in Nove from November 2022. Each new addition to this line forms part of the five and a half figure range and features new decoration as well as multiple points of articulation. Here's what to look out for with details behind each of them. So first off, we have the 13th Doctor set. This action figure set includes the 13th Doctor in her inverse flux outfit from Once Upon a Time, a TV transmitted weeping angel with alternate head heads in the assortment from Village of the Angels and Yasmin Khan with alternate head and updated decoration. The 9th Doctor set is the next one to look out for. This action figure set includes the 9th Doctor as the TARDIS emergency hologram from the Parting of the Ways, the 9th Doctor with updated head, jacket and new decoration, and Rose Tyler from Series 1 with updated decoration. Next we have the 1st Doctor and the Electronic TARDIS set. This rather unique set includes the 1st Doctor as portrayed by David Bradley in Twice Upon a Time and a decorated Electronic TARDIS, with to TARDIS toy with sound and lights. Then we have the History of the Daleks, History of the Daleks 11, Genesis of the Daleks set. The Dalek figures here represent two of the four Daleks used in Genesis of the Daleks. It might be expected that a story concerning the origins of the Daleks would mean that they'd have that they would have been refurbished to match that of the original 60s Daleks. However, because the story was so drastically different and set in an unending war zone. Uh, the Daleks were a shiny gunmetal gun grey. This was in keeping with the materialistic tones of the story. Although, this is, although it is one of the simpler colour schemes for, in the Daleks history, the Genesis Daleks have gone on to be the most, one of the most iconic. Then we have History of the Daleks set 12, and it's pretty much the same. They were given new eye stalks and uh, war, uh, war in appearance, the props arguably look like remnants of a Dalek army uh, and then we have finally we have special a special release called the creation of the Daleks collector set um, the final item and special release set of for this year is also tied to the 1975 story Genesis of the Daleks and features a different Dalek prop and an iconic moment from the story this set includes a prototype and leader Dalek plus accessories plus a da and a Davros action figure as portrayed by Michael Wisher. This set is inspired by two of the most iconic moments in Genesis of the Daleks. The first is when the lone original prototype Mark III travel machine, later destined to be renamed as a Dalek, is being tested out in the wasteland by its creator Davros. In this scene, the Dalek is furnished with its uh, with its means to interact with its surroundings via its new manipulator arm and fo focused energy weapon. The second is when later we see a repeat of the moment. Uh, this Dalek is easy to spot as during its time on screen. It usually it is usually the leader and a and sports a distinctive bronze gun arm swivel ball. Uh, also in this set is a re-release of the Davros figure with updated paint decoration and still featuring the prop the pop open panel on his Dalek style chair base. These action figures are available from B&M in the UK from November 2022. These are all the new sets coming to your toy shelves very soon. I'll have more uh, Doctor Who news in the meantime uh, very shortly in the meantime um, if you want to see more videos like this do stick around and subscribe to the channel uh, as well as share the video on social platforms you know the drill um, I'll be back later in the week with my review of Power of the Doctor uh, coming to you sometime soon on the YouTube screen near you very soon thank you for watching and I'll see you very soon bye bye